Yo, what's good, YouTube? It's your boy, Bargress, making progress back with another video. And today, I want to give y'all a little tip on how to get better at this YouTube game, how to um, actually find ways and avenues to get better and actually grow and, like, just become... Like, just to upgrade your whole YouTube experience and, and, and just every aspect of the YouTube, you know what I'm saying? Just the whole YouTube thing, you know what I'm saying? Like, a lot of people looking at me crazy right now just because I subscribe to an OnlyFans. That's literally a whole nother YouTube creator who's not even going to see this video because he has so much shit to do in life. That he is literally giving people the YouTube game, giving people the sauce, the drip on how you can yourself make money off of youtube get your shit monetized remove yellow marks off of your videos how to make 15 videos a day how to literally how much money you're gonna be making off of these videos and everything like he giving people the sauce bro i'm talking the sauce you feel me he's not playing bro like if y'all don't know already man go subscribe to pontiac made ddg uh ddg vlogs um he got so many channels i don't even want to shout out every single channel but go Go link with him, bro. Go go see what he's talking about, bro. Because literally, he is real. He real life giving people the sauce on there. I subscribe um, for the fact that I've been waiting on something like this from him for years, bro. I've been supporting this man since 300k subscribers. If you know, then you know. You know what I'm saying? I was here before the rice gum diss track. I was with him before the, the 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 reaction videos. I was here before he really, 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 really. Really, really blew up. You know what I'm saying? Before the music, I was here before he went to go see Zaytoven. I was here before he started making a whole bunch of like, like I'm talking a lot of videos with Von Von and them. Like I was there way before all of that. You know what I'm saying? I've been a, a like, I don't even want to say a lifetime supporter because he had videos before that. And like the video that got me hooked on him, I'll tell y'all right now, the video that got me hooked on him was the YouTube ad video. That was the funniest video I have ever seen at that point. I'm like, this nigga is funny as hell. And the only reason I remember was because it was a different type of video. It was actually funny. And it was just creative all around the board. So I looked it up again. And ever since I looked it up again, I'm like, bro, this dude funny. You know what I'm saying? He actually, like, like he doing good on YouTube. He got some views on here. Let me see what he's talking about. So ever since then, I've been subscribed to his channel. He literally had, I don't even know if he had 350K. He probably had around, like, 350K something like that but if you a long lifetime supporter you would know that this dude been at he was at 300k for the longest time bro i'm talking the longest time he could not get past 300k for real and when he did it was like when he started doing the toilet paper for it. like i was here before the toilet paper for it videos like bro like people don't know man i've been subscribed to him for a long time bro so when people come up to me and be hating and tell me telling me this and that about him it's like bro i've been i've been watching this nigga the whole time i watched him blow up i watched him do his thing i watched him be the realest and one of the realest niggas on youtube and he's still continuing to carry that title bro to this day he literally made a only fans for the fact that he is going to be giving people the YouTube game, the YouTube trip. He's going to be giving y'all all types of gems, all type of secrets and everything about YouTube. How to run this platform. You feel me? So the reason why I'm literally daily uploading right now is because of him. Because he made this OnlyFans and I watched the OnlyFans and I got hella, hella, hella motivated because he literally got a mansion off of this shit. He literally bought a whole I-8 at the age of 18 years old off of YouTube. He literally was able to drop out of college at the age of 18 for YouTube. What is wrong with y'all, bro? What is wrong with niggas, bro? Anybody hating on me right now, bro? You're the dumbest nigga ever because this nigga made it, bro. He literally made it. He made it to where we want to be. What is wrong with you? Literally a whole mansion in LA. A lot of people can't even afford an apartment in LA. A studio apartment. A one-room apartment in LA. A lot of regular humans cannot afford that. He went from a regular apartment to an, a, a norm, another apartment to, like, he lived in the same apartment as Logan Paul, which is something, something y'all, a lot of y'all don't even know, bro. Like, this nigga is really giving YouTube drip, bro. When it, when YouTubers do certain stuff like that, bro, and you've been watching somebody for a long time and they do something to help they, they supporters out and really build them, like, I don't think no other YouTuber did anything compared to this at this point. I don't think anybody did anything compared to this. Nobody. You feel me? Diddy G, if you watching this by any chance in the world, bro, I guarantee you, my nigga, 
I should be one of the people that you sign to your label for the simple fact that I am ready and willing to do. I ain't going to say anything because there's some weird shit that people going to think of as soon as I say I do anything. For my career, I will literally do, you know what I'm saying? I'll put in all the work that is necessary. I'll put in all the studio time that's necessary. All of the songs that I'm making right now, a lot of people don't need, like, you you yourself won't even know, bruh. I done made so many songs this year, it's fucking crazy, okay? I'm gonna tell us right now. I'm about to cuss all type of shit in this video. Fuck this video. Nigga, I done made so many goddamn songs this year. Freestyle, my nigga, is fucking stupid. I literally, I went to Florida, okay? I went to, I took a Miami trip. Then I ended up going to Orlando, linking with a girl that I met online and shit. And then I ended up uh showing her like I, I knew her before though like i knew her some months before so we talked and shit it wasn't just no super duper random person but i linked with her we riding in the car she taking me back to where i was supposed to be because i was about to get my flight the next day and the whole time i'm in the car playing songs now i thought that the songs was gonna end up stop playing but every time that a song ended i'm like oh shit here go another song oh shit here go another song oh shit here go another song i'm like bro I done freestyled so many fucking songs this year. I lost count on how many fucking songs that I made, bro. It's at least, I want to say at least 30 songs, bro. At le I'm not even playing. Freestyle, they all raw. They catchy shit. I'm on some new wave shit. I'm on some some my own different type shit. Some out of the box shit. Like, I come out with, I come out with all type of fucking songs if you don't know already, bro. If, any, if by any chance you're watching this fucking video, bro, I swear to God, bro. You have to sign a nigga like me to do it, bruh. If you can't sign me specifically, please sign somebody like me. Because I don't think it's anybody else really like me in this fucking world, bruh. Like, period. Like, no human being is like me. You feel me? I done made so many fucking songs this year. It's fucking retarded. Um, you're not gonna waste your money spending money on niggas, on, on a nigga like me. Because a lot of niggas around me literally tell me all the time, like, bruh, you should have more than what the fuck that you have. 300 subscribers is not enough for you. You should have way more subscribers than this. You should have way more fans than this. You should be rich off of the shit that you're doing. You should be famous off of the shit that you're doing. A lot of people tell me shit like that all the fucking time, bro. And I'm like, dude, I know. I'm just going to keep continuing to work at the greatest fucking level that I can. If you haven't already, go listen to some of the shit that I got out on iTunes and shit like that. You're going to see the type of artist that I am. I'm very creative. I'm very witty. I'm very in-depth with my shit. I'm deep as fuck with my shit. I think about all my shit. I'm clever as hell. I'm just unpredictable in every aspect. I'm so unpredictable, bro. It's crazy as fuck. So, just know, man. All right, back, back, back to the regular YouTube shit. Back to the regular shit. All right, I'm gonna talk to my supporters now. You feel me? So, since we're here, bro, like, look, like, a lot of people gonna look at it as as it's weird because it's the OnlyFans. But literally, he said on the OnlyFans and on his YouTube and on his Instagram and on his Twitter. There's no weird shit that's about to get posted. There's nothing sexual that's about to get posted. Nothing 18 plus is going to get posted on there. Everything he's posting on there is literally YouTube gems. He's just getting on there so he can be able to make money off of it and still be able to be himself, to be able to cuss and everything like that. That's why he did the OnlyFans. It's like $15 a month. I paid my 14 It's like $14.95. Not even $15. It's like $14.95, bro. What is wrong with niggas? Go on this, go on this nigga OnlyFans, bro. He dropping a lot of shit on there, bro. He already giving niggas the sauce, bro. He done showed niggas how to make at least 15 reaction videos a day. If you want to become a reaction channel, if you don't if you don't even want to become a reaction channel, the reason why I made a whole nother reaction video is because of him. I done made some views off of the off of the re off of the old uh reaction videos that I done did already. You know what I'm saying? I didn't need him to tell me that for real, for real, but it's just that I needed the motivation to come up with some new shit to do on YouTube because YouTube was one of the slowest fucking things that I was doing. All of the music that I'm doing is fast as fuck. I'm making the new music. I can make new music every single fucking day if I want to. I literally just sat on the phone with that same girl that I was just talking about and freestyled for her for like 10 minutes. I just spit. But I just freestyled for her for like 10 minutes. And everything that I was saying was different on every single fucking beat. I'm singing. I'm rapping. I'm, I'm doing all kind of shit, bro. I swear to God. I'm so fucking serious. I'm not playing. I'm not about to be promoting this nigga and shit like that. You know what I'm saying? But even though I want him to make his money, bro. Like, I want this nigga to make his money. I watch all his fucking ads. I watch all his fucking videos. Nigga, I subscribe to every fucking channel. I listen to all the fucking music. Every song. I don't care if it's ass or whatever the fuck. I still listen to it through the first time. Just to see if it's something that I like about it. So make sure that y'all out here supporting y'all motherfucking YouTubers and pay attention to the right fucking YouTubers. Y'all niggas ain't even watching the right niggas to begin with, bruh. I don't know why I'm doing this with my hand like I'm Mr. Krabs. Nigga, 
Y'all are not watching the right niggas, bro. I swear to God, y'all niggas not, bro. I watch different type of niggas. These niggas is real as fuck. These niggas is funny as hell. These niggas is different as fuck. You know what I'm saying? And once I get to the point where I'm able to fucking meet these niggas, bro, we're going to become the greatest niggas that ever fucking exist. I swear to God, we on some new wave shit, bro. I'm like an enlightenment thinker, bro. I'm a fucking prophet. I got a whole bunch of crazy ass ideas. If I meet a nigga like that, bro, and I'm able to actually bring these fucking ideas into life, my nigga, do you understand how fucking powerful and how fucking rich and famous I will be? I will be, be way beyond this point, bro. I'll be shitting on myself. I'll be shitting on my motherfucking self. I'll be wiping my ass with money at that point. Fuck is wrong with y'all niggas, man? Get y'all head in the motherfucking game, man. This mini boy Barker's making fucking progress, my nigga. I'm out. I'm out.